Welcome to Pro Wrestling History Daily Top 5. I'm your host, the eclectic gentleman, Stefan Watts, and join me as I count down the top five moments for this day in pro wrestling history. But before we get started, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. And without further ado, let's get our wrestling history on. Number 5, 1995. Jesse James Armstrong and Tracy Smothers defeat PG-13 for the USWA Tag Team Titles in Memphis, Tennessee, ending PG-13's ninth reign with the belts. Number 4, 2020. Tracy Smothers passes away. Best known for his appearances in WCW, Smoky Mountain Wrestling, the WWF, and ECW, the Wild Eye Southern Boy captured many hearts. Number 3. 2000, Tenru defeats Kawada in a tournament final to win the vacant All Japan Pro Wrestling Triple Crown Championship. Number 2, 1951, Iron Mike Sharp is born. A second generation wrestler whose father and uncle, Mike and Ben Sharp, also competed in the profession. Sharp was a mainstay for various territories throughout the United States and became a regular for both the WWF and New Japan Pro Wrestling. After his retirement from in-ring competition, he opened a wrestling school in Asbury Park, New Jersey, where he trained such wrestlers as Charlie Haas and Nova. Number 1. 1940. Leslie Milady is born, better known by Les Thatcher. He is a retired professional wrestler and trainer. He helps run Elite Pro Wrestling Training, a professional wrestling school in his hometown of Cincinnati, Ohio with Ricky Steamboat. He is also on the board of directors of the Cauliflower Alley Club. He has won several regional championships with various partners, including Nelson Royal and Roger Kirby, but is best known for being one of the greatest junior heavyweights of all time. And that's our list. Make sure to comment below what you feel was the number one moment for this day in pro wrestling history.